helping me to feel pretty when I'm feeling just big and bloated and I don't like putting on clothes anymore. It's just that miserable part of the third trimester. So this is gonna really, really help. Hello, my friends. Welcome back. Today, we are doing a fun haul. I am so excited because I got a whole bunch of clothes and one fun accessory from a company called Moss Rose. I cannot say enough good things about this company, first of all. They reached out to me. They wanted to know if I wanted to do a collaboration. I was going through something with the baby medically last week and I just didn't have enough time to respond to them. They reached back out to me and they were like, how do you feel about these pieces? They sent me a whole bunch of links to pieces that they wanted to send to me to try on in a video. So I looked at them, I'm like, cool, love those, send them over. And then I was looking through the website a little further and I found this one breast that I'm gonna save until the end because it's my favorite. So I reached back out and I said, I'm so sorry. I just found this dress. I'm obsessed with it. Can I swap it out for one of the kimonos that you're going to send me? And they were like, no problem. We'll just add it to the order. Amazing customer service, adorable outfits, so affordable. I cannot say enough. So here's how we're going to do this. I'm going to film this in two parts because full disclosure, hashtag third trimester life, my energy is down the toilet. I am so tired the past couple of weeks. It's just my body, I guess, preparing for baby. He's growing, taking all of my energy. So I will do this sit down part and then I will add in the try on parts later because I just don't have much energy at this very moment to go dig out all of my maternity jeans that I have packed away to mail to my sister who needs some. But I'm so excited that this package came today because I just bought a pair of white maternity shorts that are in the wash. So it works itself out perfectly. Without wasting any more time, let's go through these. I'm really excited because I'm almost nine months pregnant and these are going to work for me and anywhere down to an extra small because they're all one size. They are all flowy, a lot of beachy type of looks, but you can wear them maternity. You can wear them plus size. You can wear them to take a visit outfit up to the next level. I used to love wearing this kind of stuff over a pair of jeans and a t-shirt or a tank top to when I would go visit Adam just to kind of put some color in my life and some pattern and to make it fun, but it was always acceptable because it had sleeves. You get it. Okay, so let's open the one accessory that I think is adorable. I wish that I had this last Sunday. I don't have any little reusable bags. I love this. It's got, you know, like an umbrella, how an umbrella has that strap that snaps together so you can keep it small. It's this cute little satchel. It's a reusable shopping bag. It says, please be mine. It's literally like umbrella material. So you could use it when you go to the grocery store to be green. You don't have to use plastic bags and you can just wipe it down if you have frozen food in there or even meats in there that'll wash really well this would have been so perfect on sunday adam and i went to the gym but immediately following the gym we had to go to an event for him for work so we showered at the gym we took off our stinky smelly clothes and i didn't have a bag in the house like this this would have been so perfect to pack my stuff in so i just pulled out one of the baby's diaper bags figuring the inside would be something i could wipe down and we threw our filthy sweaty clothes in there and our sneakers in there and i just took it out and i wiped it down really well afterwards but my shoes were falling out it wasn't really big enough because it's not made for that this would have been so perfect for something like that like this would be awesome as a gym bag because you have so much room in there. This would even work in the winter when you have sweatshirts and boots and bigger clothes. And then you either wipe it down because it's waterproof, but you could throw it right in the wash and you don't have to worry about stinky bags. So I'm obsessed with this. Plus the little girly pattern with the hearts and it says, please be mine. But they also had other patterns on the website. This one is awesome. I'm taking this to the store today though. I'm about to go to Walmart to get some groceries for dinner. Ooh, this material. I wish you could feel this beautiful material. This is a gorgeous kimono. It's this gorgeous hot pink color that I don't know if it's coming through on camera with my lighting. It's this really pretty silky material. It says effortless, playful, versatile. Yes, you could wear this on vacation or to the pool as a cover up, but also this is dressy. I would wear this over all white in the summer or on vacation or 
white tank top and jeans with some sort of a wicker shoe, a brown shoe. Oh my gosh, you could do so, so much with this. You could do this over all black, do this with denim. You could do this over even a dress. You could do this over leggings or a cat suit. You could do so much with this, dress it up. This is gorgeous. I love this piece. Should we do all the kimonos first and then we'll do dresses? That's what we'll do. Okay, so here's another kimono. This is such a pretty color. So it's the same style, but it's this really pretty pattern. It's navy blue background with pink and light blue. I love this because while I'm pregnant, this late in the game especially, I'm living for leggings and tank tops. That's about as far as I can go when I get dressed up all through second trimester, all through third trimester, even first trimester really, because you just feel blah, right? And then as you get bigger, for me personally, anything touching here because my skin is now so stretched, it hurts. I can't wear jeans because my legs are too swollen. They don't fit in them anymore. So I'll wear really stretchy leggings and then a tank top and I'll throw on a kimono to dress it up. And I only had one. So this is just absolutely perfect. Again, you could wear this over a bathing suit to the pool. You could wear it on vacation. You could even wear this to church or work, anything, because it's so fancy. You could dress this up even further, wear it with a dress. Like if you have like a plain little black dress and maybe you're going to a baby shower for, you could do a little boy or a little girl because there's pink or blue. You could use it to level up an outfit like leggings or a cat suit. Mm -hmm. Love that. Oh, this is so pretty. Look at this pattern. This one, it's a little bit more of a cottony material. It's just giving me all of the brunch vibes. And look at the sleeves are gorgeous. Oh my goodness. I see this with a pair of white jeans, which I don't have in maternity. And I'm so sad because I would love to style it for you like that. But I see it with a pair of white jeans and a tank top and just like a nice tan heel or a wedge or even just a flat like a really pretty sandal that you could do so so much with this just giving me all of the gossip girl vibes you could do this almost as like a blazer jacket at work you could wear this so many different ways i'm so excited for this one and it's a really nice thick cottony material. These two are more of a silky material and this is more of a cottony one. But what I love about this is you could take it on vacation or to visit. You could throw it in a suitcase and it's not going to wrinkle because it already has that kind of like wrinkled look to it. It's like that wrinkle free material and it already has kind of a little bit of ribbing in there. So you wouldn't see that. I love this. This is so perfect for vacation. Ooh, this one is giving me all of the beach vibes. Oh, how pretty is this? So this is another shawl. This one is sleeveless. So you just put your arms through here. It's a short sleeve, little cover up. It's long in the back. This I would love to take on vacation. You could do so much with this. You could wear this. Let's say you're on vacation or it's the summer and you're going out to dinner or you're going to the pool. You could wear this in so many different ways over so many things, over a bikini, over denim shorts, over a skirt. Also, sometimes a trick I like to do with these, you could wear it as a scarf. Nobody would know that it's a kimono. You could do so many different things with this and it has such a cute little vacation tropical floral print to it. Love this. And these are all one size fits most. There's plenty of room in there. I love how it has little slits on the side. You could even make this a dress if you wanted to, the way that you kind of, you could put it on and you could tie it around your body. So many different things you could do with this. I love this. And this is a really, really soft, thin cottony material. Love it. Oh, this one is so pretty. This one is very similar. Here's your armhole. It's the same exact feel, material, cut as the one before this. I love how it has that pattern on the end by the sleeves. Same thing with this. This would be perfect to throw in a suitcase to do as a bathing suit cover up. You could do this to elevate an outfit. You could bring this on vacation. You could wear it as a scarf. You could do so, and a dress. You could do so many different things with this. You could wear it over a dress. I love this. I love that fabric. I also love how this could be a transitional piece. Because of the color, I think you could wear this as soon as you're coming out of winter and you need to transition 
transition into more spring summery stuff, but also because it has a little bit of that salmon orangey vibe, I would wear this into the fall. I would wear it over black in the fall versus wearing it over white in the summer. So this one is a winner for me. I love this. These are all winners. There's one more kimono, but it's my fave. So I'm gonna save it to the end. This is a beach cover-up dress or a pool cover-up dress. I love this because it's asymmetrical. So for girls like me who carry our weight in our lower body, it's really flattering. It's gonna be flattering on anybody, but that's a really flattering look if you have kind of curves. I love that V-neck in the front. It's just so airy and loose. In the back, it has that little detail across there. So pretty, adjustable straps. This is so great for the pool, for the beach, for vacation, for just kind of hanging around the house. Running errands when you wanna look a little more dressed up. You could also put on some heels with this and some jewelry and you could dress it up and you can make it an outfit. This is that same light cotton material. Might be a little bit see-through, so you probably wanna keep this to the beach, but you could also put on fun undergarments and wear it like that. I love how it has slits on the sides. I just love the color of it, giving me all the boy mom vibes because, you know, story of my life nowadays. Love this. This is another kimono that I saved for almost last because it's gorgeous. The color of it reminds me of going back to school in the fall. It's just that perfect fall look. Not to say you can't wear this in the summer because you can. I would wear this in the summer over all white, white jeans or white denim shorts and a white tank top. Or you could wear it with medium to light wash denim shorts or jeans like a, like a skinnier jean with a white or a tan tank top. And that's totally summery, but I'm getting all of the transitional fall vibes from this. I would wear it over medium wash. You can even do a dark wash with this, depending on your mood, with some sort of white tank top or even a high neck and put it off the shoulder with some sort of fringe heel or open toe booty. Oh my goodness, the possibilities are endless with this. I see it in the fall, but you could totally wear this all summer long. It's this beautiful burgundy color that would be unexpected in the summer anyway. Oh, I love this. It's got this dainty little floral print on there mixed into this diamond pattern. It's really pretty. And this is the same material as this. It's a little bit thicker than the other one, but it's not silk, it's cottony, and it has just this open arm. I'm loving this. See, I could see this in the fall in New Jersey when it's still hot, but I could see this also through the winter in Las Vegas where I live now. Love this. And then this is the final piece that they threw in because I asked them to swap another one out and they're like, we got you. Don't worry. So excited. Every time I see hot pink and red together, put in the comments who you, who this reminds you of. For me, it's my girl, Sarah Jessica Parker. I can't remember if it was a two piece or whatnot, but everyone always used to have a huge problem with pink and red being worn together, saying that it clashes and she brought it back and she made it hot. And this is just this gorgeous maxi with this little red top, the hot pink bottom. I live for combining these two colors and color blocking these. So this is a very sheer maxi dress with a slit up the side. It, I believe is one size. This is a, they gave me a large or an extra large because of my belly. So I hope this fits on my belly, but I am sure this will fit me after baby too because it has adjustable straps. And with something like this, it doesn't matter if it's flowy. Usually I wear a small or a medium when I don't have this big old baby bump, but I am sure this is gonna be fine. And it's gonna take me a while to get rid of this big old baby bump. And I am having my baby in July. So this is going to be absolutely perfect while I still have my baby weight on me. I can't wear, wait to wear it somewhere. Maybe Adam and I will have to go to Lake Las Vegas or something and rent a boat. I told him I wanted to do that for my birthday and I'm like, can't be this birthday because I'm expecting a baby like seven days before. But that's okay. So you guys tell me what is your favorite of all of these in the haul? Can you even pick just one? Because they are all so incredible. I can't, but no, I can't. I was just gonna say, I guess if I had to pick a favorite kimono, it would be this one. But honestly, the silky ones, like they're all gorgeous. And this dress is just to die for. And I don't even think I have bikini cover-ups. I've been wearing my loose maternity overalls to the pool literally every single day day to get in some exercise for me because I'm not moving as much as I used to with this big old <laughs> belly.
jelly. So this is incredible. Let me know what you guys liked in this haul. Let me know if you got anything. Make sure you check out Moss and Rose. Again, thank you so much for sending me all of this and helping me to feel pretty when I'm feeling just big and bloated and I don't like putting on clothes anymore. It's just that miserable part of the third trimester. So this is gonna really, really help. I love you guys so much and I'll see you in the next one. Mwah.